On Tuesday, the ruble opened the session amid favorable market conditions. The U.S. dollar is widely depreciating against the basket of other majors. Meanwhile, the Russian stock market went up thanks to rising oil prices. So today, the ruble benefits from such factors as the overall optimism in global exchanges, the easing U.S. dollar and the lack of negative news from Belarus. Brent crude has hit new highs for the first time after the pandemic. On August 31st, Brent was trading at $46.05 per barrel in the mid-session. The improved outlook for the economic recovery in China and the US could have supported oil prices. Oil was up on Tuesday morning as a fall in the US dollar supported fuel prices. In the morning trade, Brent oil futures advanced by 1.1% to $45.78 per barrel. US WTI crude rose by 1.01% to settle at $43.04 a barrel. The US dollar was last seen down by 0.3% against the basket of major currencies. Against the euro, it lost 0.45%. The changes in the US Federal Reserve policy increased the possibility of negative interest rates, which would definitely weigh on the greenback. The weakening US dollar makes oil and other commodities more attractive to global buyers. The Russian stock market opened the day in positive territory amid higher crude prices and overall positive background. According to the Moscow exchange, the ruble index rose by 0.2% in the early session up to 2,972 points, while the Russian trading system index for the US dollar went up by 1.1% to 1,272 points. On Tuesday, September 1st, the dollar-ruble pair is trading at the level of 73.58. Yesterday, the weighted average exchange rate was seen at 73.80. According to the central bank official exchange rate, the ruble appreciated against the dollar by 83 kopecks. On Saturday, the ruble also advanced against the euro by 92 kopecks. Today, the ruble is extending gains thanks to a rise in global exchanges, gains in oil prices and a relatively stable geopolitical situation in Belarus. The dollar-ruble pair returned to the level of 74 last seen in early August. However, the yields of the federal loan bonds dropped as the ruble went higher last week. This means that the ruble appeal rises among investors. The imports volumes have also decreased due to the weak demand for major purchases, including imported goods. The weakening American currency makes oil and other commodities priced in dollars more attractive to global investors. With Brent futures holding near $46 per barrel, the ruble is unlikely to radically change its trajectory. We expect to see the dollar-ruble pair moving below the mark of 74 in the first half of the day. In the near future, the dollar may drop even lower and settle below this level. That's all for now. Thank you for watching and stay tuned.